Has uh, Adam offered you a hot drink, Colin? That's very kind. Do you have a lem sip? I was thinking more along the lines of a, a tea or a coffee. It's just I've got a bit of a cold coming on. I thought I'll cut it off at the pass. Um, Earl Grey dash of milk would be lovely, thanks. OK, I'll see if I can find a uh, paracetamol to crush up into it. Thank you. I nearly went into the law myself, you know. Oh, yeah, why didn't you? Yeah, it's too straight laced for me. I'm a rebel, maverick. Always got a craving for excitement. And here you are buying a small news agent. Tell you what, you must be ready to explode. Exactly, compadre, exactly. With a client. And he needs to know he's got a thief for a solicitor. Oh, hi. Careful, a slander. You stole our machines. And we've got the proof. <laughs> Colin, would you mind coming back tomorrow? Well, I'll have to check my diary. Or you can hire a solicitor who isn't completely bent. I hope that isn't aimed at me. You know it isn't. Poor choice of words. Actually, I can check my palm pilot now. <sighs> See this? Your business card was at the very place where one of our machines was found. You found your machines? One of them. Oh, I know it's ours because it had an identifying mark on it. An identifying mark? Uh, yeah, we'll be telling all this to the police, of course. I know they don't call them palm pilots anymore, but years ago, I was the first person to get one at work. In fact, it was my nickname for a while. Your nickname was Palm Pilot? Sounds about right. Listen, you've no proof whatsoever. Our cards are everywhere. It's called advertising. Right, I'm off. Where are you going? I'm sure you can handle these gentlemen by yourself now. Come on, Palm Pilot. Come on, I'll walk you out. And we can work out another appointment for you. All right. We've got you banged to rights. Oh, really? Well, I don't see any evidence at all. Just the car that of a hundred shops we left them in. Now, if you don't mind, some of us got a business to run. We know it was you. You either couldn't have pulled this off by yourself. You've been sniffing around for months. A little word slander springs to mind. It's all starting to add up. And once we've got enough on you, you're going down. We're coming for you, son. Right, Rana. Hi. Two sets. I'll just be with the girls. Yeah. How was your afternoon with Sophie? I don't know what you think you're up to. I'm not up to anything. I just... Listen, if you're confused about it... <laughs> you really think I'm a lesbian? Just because of something that Nutter Imogen said? I'm not saying that. Oh, some kind of recruitment drive. If I've got the wrong end of the stick... You I... have. I'm straight, OK? Married to the man I love. We're starting a family for your information. So do me a favour, Todd, and leave me alone. So you didn't get in trouble? Nah, I got to wash Roy's car, that's all. And if Dad starts, I'll just turn on the waterworks. Can never deal with that. I want in. You! Don't think you've got what it takes. Of course I have. Let's talk tomorrow. I'll think of a really special first air. All right, girls, behaving yourselves. Always. 